Hello everyone and thanks for tuning back in. Alessandro the Crypto here. I hope you're doing all fine. So welcome to another episode. Today we're going to analyze as usual the Bitcoin price. We're also going to have a look into Ethereum and also into the US dollar index, the DXY. So we're going to start here in the four hour time frame in the Bitcoin price because yesterday we had here this breakout out of the symmetrical triangle to the downside. We bounced exactly as we were expecting it here at the 20 moving average in the four hour time frame. And also here the four hour is looking very bullish again, even though we are still getting rejected by the nine moving average. But as soon as we're going to have a four hour close above the 20 and nine moving average here, let's say above $45,500. I'm pretty confident that we will gear up again for the next big move to the upside because the four hour currently is bouncing off from the 50 level in the RSI, which of course is very bullish. And also in my own indicator, we could maybe get a buy signal very soon. It wouldn't be a good one, but at least we could get a buy signal, which indicate that we will see continuation to the upside. And we can also here extend a little bit this triangle and you can see that we are still facing here this resistance that we had since uh, the top here at $48,000. So if we correct this line here, if we extend it, you can see that we're still struggling here to break through and we can do the same thing here also with the support that we currently have down here approximately at around 43 to 42 thousand dollar so this all could end up in a big uh, bull flag that of course uh, could break out to the upside and therefore we're gonna see 50 and potentially even 60k here in the bitcoin price pretty soon if here we're gonna get a breakout to the upside so as soon as we're gonna have a four hour close above 45 thousand five hundred dollars above this resistance i'm pretty confident that we will see continuation to the upside and we most likely also are getting here a buy signal so we have green light to open up some nice longs here on Bybit or Femex and even if we go over into the one hour time frame so into the lower time frames you can see that currently the one hour looks quite oversold and also we are gearing up again here to break to the upside because we are again closing one hour candles above the 9 and 20 moving average so the one hour looks like that we are building up some nice momentum to the upside and we could also here break out to the upside any moment i don't think that we will go down again to revisit this 42 to 43 thousand dollar area most likely we're gonna stay here at around 45 to 44 thousand before we're gonna see the breakout but let's see the one hour and four hour are looking very bullish and if you're trading over on discord with my own indicator that you can get in my discord trading chat for a little donation here we are trading the three hour time frame and as you can see we are bouncing from the ema ribbon and also we could get very very soon a buy signal here and that of course then is a good sign to go along and we are expecting here a big push to the upside of course so i'm still waiting here for this buy signal to occur here in the three hour time frame so close at least a three hour close above 46,000. that should be okay then to open up some nice longs and ride it up to the upside so the three hour is the time frame that, that usually we are trading over on uh, discord if you're trading with my own indicator otherwise you just have to wait for a four hour close above the resistance in order to have the confirmation that we gear up here for another big move to the upside and now we can go over into the daily time frame because here even though the of course the daily time frame is still looking bullish i have some warning signs here in my own indicator you can see that very soon we could maybe get a sell signal if here we are not able to break out to the upside in the next coming hours or days so if we're gonna get rejected here and gonna fall again to the downside then watch out for the nine daily moving average right here at the 0.618 fibonacci retracement from the bottom that we had here before the breakout here of 37,000 and the local top here at 48,000. So if we're gonna get rejected here, we maybe could get here a sell signal and this will indicate that we will drop towards the nine daily moving average here at 41,600. And in the worst case, if this support will not hold, we're gonna fall all the way down again towards the 20 daily moving average at 37. 
thousand so this is also what we have to see here if we are not able to break out here to the upside with these bullish signs that we have in the lower time frames then this could get dangerous here because in that case we're gonna fall again towards 40k potentially even a little bit below 40,000. Also the RSI right now is looking a bit concerning here. We are quite overbought and uh, there could be also a bearish divergence here unfolding. So also this is of course a bearish sign and this also could indicate that even maybe if here we're going to see a breakout to the upside, we're going to have to see what will happen here with the indicator and of course also with the RSI because uh, if we're getting too much overbought, we could drop at any time again. Even if here we're going to see a breakout to the upside, back down towards a 9 or 20 daily moving average which currently are here at 41,037,000. ,000. So in my opinion Bitcoin most likely is going to have here a breakout to the upside so I'm going to trade here with a long position but keep in mind that the daily time frame is looking a bit concerning so here I'm expecting even with a possible pump here a short lift pump to the upside within this week that sooner or later we we are coming potentially down to test the 9 or 20 daily moving average and then of course we're gonna have to see where they are located and now we can go over into the ethereum chart as well because also here we're still trading above the nine daily moving average so as long as we are keeping up with this support here as long as we're closing daily candles above this moving average we should be good to go to the upside and if bitcoin is going to break out to the upside today or latest in the next coming days also here in ethereum i'm expecting the price to go straight towards two thousand dollar to then retest this resistance that we have above of us but ethereum is also looking very bullish and also here in the four hour time frame, you can see that we are now closing again candles above the 20 moving average, which of course is bullish and also the RSI bounce from the 50 level. So both Ethereum and Bitcoin are looking very bullish and I'm expecting here continuation to the upside. We have very similar patterns here in Ethereum and Bitcoin. So if Bitcoin is gonna break out to the upside, you can of course also trade Ethereum with a long over on Bybit or Femex because like this, you can also do some nice gains and now we can go over into the dxy chart because here we are still struggling to have a bounce at the 200 moving average in the four hour so in theory here we should expect a big bounce to the upside and that of course is bearish for the bitcoin price and even though we could see a bounce i'm not pretty convinced that we're gonna see follow through there most likely we're gonna get rejected already here at the 20 moving average latest at the 50 moving average here at 91 dollar we could see that bounce because we got the buy signal here here in the DXY we are touching a very important support level here and the RSI is very oversold so in theory we should see a big bounce here in the DXY to the upside if we're gonna fall here below and move towards our previous resistance which now could be the new support yet $89 then of course we're gonna see a big pump in the Bitcoin price and of course also in Ethereum so I'm watching here very very closely the four hour closes in the DXY and if we go over into the daily you can see that currently we are bouncing from the 50 daily moving average and here also if we're going to see a bounce most likely we're going to get rejected here at the 20 or 9 daily moving average and we are again trading below the 50 level in the rsi after getting here a sell signal after being completely overbought here so the dxy in my opinion is back into a bear trend and even though we could see here in the short time frames a bounce to the upside i'm expecting here continuation to the downside which of course is very bullish for the Bitcoin price. So my friends, we're gonna have to wait here for the next closes, hopefully above the resistance that we have here. So make sure that you're ready to trade this breakout if we're gonna see here a breakout to the upside, but make sure to lock in profits. Put a stop loss as soon as you are in profits if you see an explosive move to the upside because we could also get a huge week to the upside if the DXY is gonna also have a big pump in the next coming hour. So it's gonna be a bit difficult to trade this in my opinion because we could see here a breakout if it's going to be sustainable this is what we're going to have to see once bitcoin is starting to consolidate again because keep in mind that the daily time frame is looking like that we're going to retest here the 9 or 20 daily moving average in the next coming days most likely but before that in my opinion we're going to see here a breakout to the upside first
And with that said, guys, I'm going to wrap it up for now. If you want to trade Bitcoin, Ethereum and other cryptos up to 100x leverage, then make this over on Bybit and Femex. You can use my referrals down below here in the video description to get some extra money, some extra bonus and of course support the channel. If you don't want to trade yourself, but you want to gain as much as possible on the way up or down, then try out PrimeXPT because here you can easily copy trade other traders. And we have currently some $50 giveaway over on discord so you have to contact me over on discord to get this special $50 giveaway for prime xpt if you're using prime xpt with my referral link then make sure to contact me on discord and otherwise make sure to follow our great crypto family over on discord the link is down below here to our channel shout out to all the members over there we have a very great crypto family and for all the newcomers check out coinbase swissborg and binance down below here are all the recommended exchanges where you can easily buy some cryptos and of course also claim some free bonus if you use my links down below here on coinbase we still have some slots free to claim for example band protocol stellar orchid and so on so take this free promotion as long as they're running it and of course if you're buying the first time with your bank account or credit card for example on coinbase or swiss borg you will get some extra money so you can buy even more cryptos so if you like the content my friends make sure to hit that like button very much appreciated the more you click the like button the higher the bitcoin price is going make also sure to subscribe to the channel because i do daily ta videos and we are going to have a great time together in this bull market so thank you again very much for watching my friends and we're gonna see us all in the next one bye <laughs>